what the catchy tell? To my humble abode, I'm your hostess with the mostest, Mary. And welcome back, my subscribers. Mm, appreciate y'all, and welcome to your new viewers. Mm, I appreciate you as well. If y'all like the video, give me one or two thumbs up. Please share so I can go across the YouTube community. And subscribe. Press that notification bell that you see bing and you'll be notified each time I upload a catchy tail video for the sake of those who uh, uh, just joining us. I am a mixed media artist, so from time to time I might put up some of my artwork. I had took it down, but I'm going to put it back up now and see what happens. If anybody have interest, I'm also a musician, so I have posted some of my, uh, the music that I play to our creator on the instruments that he blessed me with. And uh, I'm also a thriftaholic and an online shopaholic, Timuholic, which includes a Timuholic and Sheenholic. <laughs> but I'm also, my forte is thrifting, and I'm a reseller on the Poshmark app at Lady Vintage Shop and Purse Attic Shop. The links to both of my Poshmark closets will be in the description below. And for the sake of all of y'all who just tuning in, too, I'm a sufferer of the debilitating condition called fibromyalgia, and I like to say this uh, in the beginning so y'all can know what's going on with me when I stagger in my speech or I go up into the distance and I forgot what I was trying to say as I'm trying to regather my thoughts. So it's not dementia or Alzheimer's or anything like that. It's called brain fog. The doctors call it that's associated with the overall body pain that I suffer with the fibromyalgia, which uh, due to the um, daily chronic fatigue syndrome as well, because I don't get the uh, rejuvenating sleep. I can sleep like up to nine hours, wake up as though I haven't been asleep, y'all. So y'all, I like to get that out there so y'all can understand what's going on with me. Not for simple for these purposes, but to explain if I'll be like staggering and become irritated. Okay, and I appreciate y'all, and thank y'all for bearing with me. Now, today is a thrift haul, and what I'm about to show y'all are clothes purses, and I don't think I have shoes today. I might have shoes. Yeah, I do have shoes today. So, shoes, clothes, and purses today, y'all, and, um, uh, Everything was from unique thrift store in the Chicago land area where I live at, and they were all half price on the day that I went there. Yeah, I got enough strength to make it on the public transportation board. I'm taking two, two buses and an L train L, y'all, because <laughs> I go far in the distance in hopes of finding what they deem luxurious items, meaning. Prada Chanel, Louis Vuitton, all that. I ain't found none of that yet. I found Gucci and uh, Coach uh, and 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 uh, Dooney and Burks. Now, some of them already listed in my Poshmark closet uh, closets in the description below all the links. And so here we go. It might be a lengthy one, y'all, and because I talk a lot too, and as y'all can tell for some of my videos. But anyway. Get something to eat or drink today. I have my trusty Victor Allen's iced coffee latte in the mocha flavor. Mmm, my favorite from the Dollar Tree. Okay, I'm going to go over here for a minute. One moment, please. Mmm, that's some good stuff. Y'all was thirsty. Okay, let's get it on, y'all. So, I'm going to go back and forth from person. See, at my first thought when I first came on was to say, like, Clothes and then purses like that, but I'm gonna just pick up stuff that way. That way, I'm gonna try to not have a part two video. Okay, so let's see. The first item will be so. As I told y'all, the my Poshmark closet name is Lady Vintage Shop for where the clothes and purses are, and then Purse Attic Shop is just for the purses, uh, in the Poshmark closet. But I like vintage, y'all. Vintage, vintage. And so I bought a couple of vintage hats. Check it out, y'all. Ooh, look at this. And it is wool. It's a wool blend. Really pretty. Red. It's by H&M, y'all. H&M. And it's a uh, size, what is that, 58 or 56? I can't see what the shade's on, y'all. 
But, uh, what did it say? This says, uh, supposed to say wool somewhere. Oh, on the back. Is that what really happened? Let's see, y'all. Y'all, excuse me, y'all. Let me bring this up. And for y'all who, who don't know, too, I buy shades from TN, Shemu, Shemu, CN and T, Timu. <laughs> and so, I buy them big enough to, uh, put on my, uh, let's put them up here and be done with this. And if I want to put them back on, just grab them back again. Y'all, excuse me, y'all. Thank you for y'all. Thank you for y'all. Okay, yeah, it's a wool there. Right up at the top. Hopefully, y'all can see that that says wool. And it's from H&M. And here's a half of them. So check it out, y'all. So this is like, I like the uh, reminiscence of the 20s, 30s, 40s, 50 wear. Mm-hmm. I like the 60s too, 60s and 70s, but I like the 20s, 30s, 1920s, 1930s, 40s, like that. So I don't know which which one this is, but let's see how it looks, y'all. Let's see how the, oh, I forgot I had the shades on, took them off without taking the shades on. What's really going on and happening with me? But anyway, check it out, y'all. And see, I like them because you can wear them any kind of way you want to. And I could dress them up by putting stuff on it. Get it now so we can see how that look. Look like look like the twenties and the thirties. <laughs> or I could have it like this. How I wanna have it, y'all? I gotta move on because I got too much stuff. What up, y'all? <laughs> but anyway, isn't that cool? Yeah. So the next item is another hat, y'all. I got like three hats. So here's another one. Check it out, y'all. Isn't that cute? It's, it's gray. Gray and white. Ooh, real pretty. Like that stone, stone gray and white. Ooh, look how pretty, y'all. And so this is by Odora. Odorahats.com. And it had the price on here. And uh, it's a newer tag. Now that go, and this is wool too. Where's that wool at? Because I saw it somewhere. Where's that? I hope everybody's doing okay. Excuse me. I apologize. I was supposed to say that when I first came on. I hope y'all doing well. And if not, remember this too shall pass. Stay encouraged, y'all. It'll be okay. In the end, it's going to pass one way or another. So it's wool. It's 77 percent wool and 30 percent polyester. Pretty. This hat. Look at this hat. So let's try on this hat, y'all. Oh, look at this hat. Mm. So I could wear it just like this. Or well, once again, I could wear it on either side. I could tilt it up if I want. You know, I would really, when I wear it, I'll really do it. Look at that. Or clip it. And it'll be clipped right, y'all. I'm just trying to go through it in a hurry. <laughs> Ooh, adorable. Wow, the things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. Same half off or the same price. There's the red one. Then I couldn't wait, y'all, when I first got home from purchasing these hats. Because I had bought three. And this a this a 100% wool hat. And so I wore it and put my brooch on it, although it didn't need a brooch on it. Check it out, y'all. Woo, jet black. So it already got that, like, the flower here. Oh, this is uh, wool, remember? So it already got the wool flower design, but I put this brooch on it. And so this is 100% wool, Yang Yang Hat Industry. 100% wool, Yang Yang Hat Industry. Hopefully y'all can see that. 
check it out, y'all. I'm like, what? I'm like, what in the world? Woo. So this is how I wore it out, basically. Put my shades on. Wow, nice. Look at this. <laughs> Piece of nothing. I think I bought these from Shein. These glasses came from Shein, I think. These. Aren't they pretty? But anyway, okay, so that's the hat. And once again, you can wear it however you want to wear it. You wear it up like that. Wear it in cocked. As usual. I like mine's cocked and tipped to the sides, you know. Cause I like that style. You know, back in the day, y'all, back in the day, they had it happening with their suits on. What's going on now with people with their pants down and got holes in their clothes walking around, but to each his own. I'm just saying, it amazes me, that's all. And uh, it's okay to disagree, and that's all. Okay, moving right along. So the next thing is, and this is another thing I wanted to mention too. Look, so you know the little glue, them little glue stickies that come with the nails. So uh, I really don't, I, I said I'm going to do a whole video. I got a bag full of nails from Shein and Timu. And I barely wear them because I like silver nail polish. And my nails, okay, nice and And so, but uh, I said since I bought them, because I'm a hoarder, y'all. I don't know if I said that I'm a professed hoarder, but an organized one. And so I'm racking up on the uh, fingernails because everything is beautiful to me. And I want everything knowing I don't need it. But anyway, I said I'm going to start wearing it. And so I was using the, uh, the little glue stickies that come with them instead of the uh, nail glue on here. And so... Now, just doing this a little bit, it seems like it's trying to lift up off the finger. But aren't they pretty? Look. So I think I got these from Shein or Timo. I forgot which one, y'all. Now check this out, y'all. Check this one out. Let me put this back up here. So I can see probably. I ain't got to take it off again because. Uh, thanks for your patience, y'all. Okay, yeah, I want to do this because I'm supposed to be going in any order. I better start showing some of these purses or might y'all might not get to see them today. It depends. This is Cynthia Raleigh, uh, USXL. And this is uh, the fabric. I'm trying to see where the fabric. It'll say something on the back, but it's not in English. I'm going to see if it's under the bottom. But it's half of It was half of this. $12.99. Since you roll it. I'm going to leave the tag on for right now. But there it is. Mm -hmm. Y'all can see that, I think. But check it out, y'all. Ooh, look at this crop cardigan sweater. Ooh, cream. It got cream gray. Or either uh, cream, that's either gray or light tan. Because my eyes sometimes uh, trick me. You know, sometimes I'm colorblind, it seems like. But anyway, so there's the colors. It got three color, color blocks. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. And look, on one arm, it got the pockets. And this either cotton or wool, we'll see in a few minutes. And look at this zipper pocket. And they function the pocket. Isn't that beautiful? And like I said, it only has the one pocket here on the sleeve. But look at this. What? I think it's a fine fabric. So y'all ain't gonna even try to put it on. And then I like the, uh, the zipper pull. Let's see. 
And this is light. This is it's like uh, how you saying it now should be how it really is. Because this is not a dark. This is not dark. Okay, let's see. The material says rayon and polyester and nylon. Really, the things you can find at the store, y'all. <laughs> I mean, that's been too much time on this stuff, y'all. I'm delighted with all this stuff, and in my delightness, time could go past. I mean, okay, let's see some bad stuff. Look at this. Well, I'm going to show that last because I, I forgot I had jewelry too, y'all. But look at this quaint vintage purse. Reminiscence of the 20s on 30s. Look at it. Pretty. So it's a leather. And it's a back pocket. Pristine condition, y'all. Pristine got feet. No way. No tag. On the corner. You see that? Beautiful. And here's the front. And this is 30 bag. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> I had to catch it because the nail about to come off. I like that nail more important than the bag. Come on in now. I mean, I mean, what's really happening and going on. But look, 30 bag. And so this is how it would look on the side. I spent too much time on stuff. I need to speed it up. But anyway, look at the nice turn up. Pretty with the cream in that one now. And so put this down. And this is all leather, y'all. All leather in the inside. Leather too, y'all. Look at this. But it has a name and it has a little pouch. I'm gonna show y'all in a minute. So this is by Chick the Paris bag. That's what it's there. Yeah. Right up there. I don't know if y'all can see it with my with my finger. Hopefully y'all can see that. Chick the Paris. Ooh. And so look at this. So we got a slot here, pocket there, slot here, middle partition, slot here, and all the inside leather. And look at the old old zipper pull. <laughs> now look what it came with, y'all. Look what it came with. Look. The leather. And it's leather. The leather. Little pouch. Mm. And look with the little colorful polka dots in there. Wow, the things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. And this is gray. This is a nice, pretty gray. Light gray. Mm -hmm. Close the back. And there you have it. And it was only half of $9.99. Mm -hmm. Just on the feet. Yeah. The things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. Okay, I'm going to show y'all this. And I didn't wipe it down. So I ain't got nothing around me to really show y'all. But uh, anyway, so I found two mirrors. They together. Like wall mirrors. Mirror. Alpha three forty nine. And so there you have it. And it's not broke on the other side. I'm trying to see how I take it off. So I got these nails on here. Come on. And see. Okay, let's see what happens. Let's get over here. Stay right there. So me taking that off, so I gotta take that off. Mm. Yeah. Oh look at this, y'all. Isn't that something? And it got the little sticker, wall stickers. <laughs> look at that. The thing you can find at that thrift store, y'all. Mm. Moving right along. Look at this pretty purse. 
Look at this pretty purse. It's silver and gold, y'all. Metallic. Metallic silver and gold. That's the color, y'all. Look at that. That's how it is. No ears, no tails in the corner. Look at this. And the pretty tassel. And look at it. It got a gold. I mean, it got some type of stone. That look like a real stone, y'all, of some sort. It's a stone. Let me take the tag off after I show y'all how much it was. And this is leather, too, y'all. Half of that. Half of something. Okay, let's take it off. So y'all can see the stone. Look at this stone. That's a real stone. I don't know what type it is. But it's a real stone. It's a real stone of some sort. And look at the the tassel. Isn't that pretty? And and the little ball to come with it. Gold. Mm. Gold and and a silver metallic purse. Mm. So I got a crossbody strap. And it adjusts, but you can't take it off. It's not removable. Look at this how this look. And here's that. And that's how this would look. And you can adjust it some more. Right here, it could still be adjusted, see? And so that's how it comes. A little under the breast there. Really pretty. Look at that bag, y'all. Yeah. Let's look at the inside and I keep the people waiting. Whew. Man, I'm messing around. Ooh. <laughs> Everything blunt, 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 blunt. Okay. So, so this is how it is. Isn't this a pretty bag, y'all? Yeah. And it's all leather. Look at this. Scrunchy leather. And so this hat open. Mm. There we go with the nail. So it has two, two zipper. One already zipped. Unzipped and I unzipped it. And here it is. And it got a cotton, like cotton sack, sack inside. With no pockets on that side other than that one compartment. And then open this one up. And they got the leather, leather pulls on them, the real leather. And so that's how they look. Let me open it all up. So there's one side, and there's the other side. And so that's all. There's two compartments, deep, nice size compartment. Really nice bag, y'all. Yeah. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Now, let me put this back in here because the price, which I showed y'all already for this bag. And there it is with the tassel. A pretty tassel with that. Look at that. I can't get over that. Let's see. Let y'all see that again. Look at that. Mm. Things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. Okay, let's go to a clothing item with time. Yeah, I might get through this. This is a skirt set, y'all. I'm going to keep this. This is a SG Sport Collection. Vintage SG Sport. It's a, a size 14, 16, 18 large. 100% polyester. And it was half of this. It's a skirt set. So there's the name. And there's the price. Mm -mm -mm. So the people could see the price. My goodness. Half of that. Mm -hmm. So it's real pretty. There's the nail again acting up. Yeah. Keep going in and out. The lighting. Sorry about that, y'all. But this a plum color. Like a plum purple. And so it got mock pockets. Let's put it on the hanger. Where's my hanger? Just had that hanger. 
they have mock pockets and they have a uh, removable shoulder pad. And here it is. They got uh, two buttons. Does that say? No, three buttons on the top. See the pretty button. The pretty button. Look at them pretty buttons. See the pretty button. Very nice button. And so it's mock pockets. They don't open. I mean, they're not functional. Mm -hmm. Real thin. Real thin. Gonna be good for spring or summer and fall months. Yep. Real nice. Real that nice material. You can see it's kind of see through a little bit. Gonna be nice. And remove shoulder pads. But I like to keep my shoulder pads in. Oh, I do. To me to help elevate the look. Again, my opinion. To each his own. So here's the skirt. Pretty skirt. Nice pretty skirt. Nice elastic. And there you go. And like I said, it's a plum purple. Very nice. Very nice. So that's mine. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to get through this because I don't have much. And so today it's cold. Um, only yesterday, when was that? The day before yesterday, I went to the zoo. And so I got some, I'm going to do a, a, a video of my, what I deem solo trip adventures around the Chicago land area. Yesterday, I went to the Lincoln Park Zoo and I spent time with the encaged ones. I was sad about it. I always get sad when I go see them, but I, I'm, I also get happy because I'm, in my mind, I think I'm helping to cheer them up when they see humans. I don't know. Because some seem to like the humans and some don't. Like the macaques, the Japanese macaque monkeys. They seem to have no problem with the uh, human presence. The lions get bored of us. And the gorillas like to show off. <laughs> and the uh, chimpanzees. Y'all watch them. They uh sneaky. This is the Vintage Caribou, New York. This is a 1X. This is a suit, too. Polyester rayon pantsuit, y'all. Half of now, 49. But look at this. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Look at that. And then it zips up. Now, what surprised me about this was, and it's olive. It's olive, but it has no pockets in the pants or the the blazer jacket. No pockets whatsoever. I'm like, how you ain't got no pockets? No pockets. I'm like, no pockets the first? Nope. No pockets. I'm like, did I miss the pocket? Nope. No pockets. And look at the collar part. Isn't that beautiful? Look at the floral print in the back on the collar. I wish it had it on the cuff, but it don't. Let's see if you can find it to thrift store, y'all. <laughs> For cheap. And, and here's the pants. Dun, 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 dun. And here they are, one next again, y'all. Look, and I like it because it got the automatic creases. It got the automatic crease. Because I like creasing my uh, dress pants. I like creasing. Sometimes I'll put a crease in my uh, in my blue jeans too. Blue jean shorts or blue jean pants. Mm -hmm. And that's how it looks in the back. But no pockets. Isn't that something? Not even on these. No pocket on land. I ain't going to have no pockets. But they don't, y'all. They don't, y'all. I like to uh, fold them where the crease was. Excuse me. <laughs> One moment, please. Mm -hmm. 
I told y'all I'm a hoarder, but I'm an organized hoarder, y'all. Yeah. There's a method to not my madness. It's a method in what I do, and I like everything decent and in order, including how you live. Although I just got too much stuff, but it's not the way you can't walk around and stuff like that and congregate and sleep. And it's not all infested with roaches and rats and pestilence. Plus, we have our trusty cat juice. He'll take care of anything, anyway, any critters that we see it. This is a vintage. Well, I don't know if it's a vintage. This is Adrian, uh, Adrian Vitadini, extra large. Uh, well, this is a, a pull-on sweater, mock turtleneck. Or is it turtleneck? Or mop turtle, no crawl neck. I guess they call it crawl neck. But there's the name Andrew and the knee and the price. Mm -hmm. I want to, I want to uh, take that off. Well, I can take it off. No, I want to take it off to take pictures and stuff. Around. But anyway, because I think I'm going to put this on gosh, y'all. I could fit it, it's my style. But I'm not. It's cream with a uh, gold metallic thread. It's sparkling. I don't know if y'all can see it. And here's the back. I don't know if y'all can see it. But it's sparkling. And plus, it got this nice design right here, y'all. This metal designer metal plate right on the front. See, see the uh, the difference in the design too. Then you go down. See the difference? Different. Beautiful. The gold metallic. Beautiful. And the uh, sleeves the same way. They're different. Print. Mm. Danger. Okay, there you go there. Okay, so I'm done with clothing. Hey, we're going to get through all of this today. Hopefully, because I got jewelry to show y'all. Oh, and, and, and let's get to this. I'm skipping all over the shoes, y'all. Excuse me, y'all. Okay, so look at this, y'all. And I got a piece of jewelry in here, one or two. But this was half of one nine Nice little uh, cosmetic bag with another bag in it. But I had put some of the jewelry that I bought, I put in here and in the other purse. So let me put that to the side. But look, another pouch was in here. So it's connected to it. I will have to disconnect it. For only that much, half of that. So this was a dollar for two. So 50 cents. And, and it works. Both zippers work. Look at that. Things are fine. Oh, yeah, I'll put that back over there. And so here's some jewelry. Here's some jewelry that I have bought. And I got some more jewelry. Let me go through this because the time going. Look at this. Isn't this pretty? Just... Just cosmetic jewelry. I like cosmetic fashion jewelry, y'all. So it's got the gold tone. Or is that silver? No, it's gold tone. It look like it's just dull looking. So it's half of two ninety nine. Mm hmm What's that, one fifty? So I didn't really look for a designer name it or brand name. But isn't it pretty? So it's acrylic. It's acrylic with all the uh the embellishment on the rhinestones and the beads. Ooh, it's not a beautiful necklace, y'all. Nice. Here's another pretty necklace. This is the uh, the fabric and bead necklace. See the fabric, and you could tie it up around your neck. Half for two ninety nine as well. And look at it. So it's coral. That was coral, two color. Coral, peachy coral. Oh, it's not orange, it's peachy coral. Isn't that pretty? Mm -hmm. Really pretty. And all the beads there. Look at that. 
the basic of finance and thrift store, y'all. Okay, so let's get to some shoes, y'all. Uh-oh. The nail uh, went backwards. Excuse me for a minute, y'all. Let me see, can I put this back on it? The nail turned around somehow. It turned around. It ain't. It didn't break. I thought it had broke this one. But it came off and turned around because it still got that uh, little square piece of glue. The acrylic, uh, the artificial nail glue. Look at these. So these are maroon. Maroon velvet. Maroon. Mm-hmm. That wine color. Look, some mules. This kind of cold reaction, y'all. And look how it is with the studs, all the studs in place. Let's look at one at a time. So I got the studs and this is my size. Mm -hmm. This is a nine and a half M white style, although I could wear a, a, I wear a 10. But I could wear a nine and a half, 10, put it that way. Cause this fit to a 10, still got a little room here at the end right there. But look, half a look, half a nine something on. Not bad. And they look new. They look new. Look at this. Mm-hmm. Wow, the things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. Look at that. Velvet. And I have a velvet dress too. A velvet dress and a velvet uh I'm looking at it right now. Velvet dress and a velvet, uh, and a velvet, uh, top that I thrifted a while ago. One moment, please. Let me see how I show y'all. Hold, please. And I'm back, y'all. So here it is. So the top is by Vintage Adrian Karen. Look, it got sequin. Ooh, velvet. Look at that, velvet, and sequins. Look at that. Ooh. You got the sequins on the back. All the sequins there don't look like it because you know how, well, no, some is gone. That was my mistake. Some are gone. Some just turned around the sequins, and, but then some actually are missing. But you can't tell because some of them, like, turned around. And it's glistening. Look at that. Ugh. So it just has the uh, velvet on the on the uh, trimming. Look at that of the cardigan. Now I wish it had it around the cuff sleeves with it on. And so that's that. And they didn't come together, and I thrifted at the same time. Both of these are thrifted. Here's a vintage, what they call sun belt, extra large, and I had these for over ten years. Both of them. Over 10 years, but it was thrifted. They were thrifted at different times. Look at this. Isn't this pretty? This velvet. So it's just past the knee. It's not what you would call a mid D, but it's a little past the knee, just a little bit. Really pretty. Look at that velvet. And so when I saw these, I was like, right on. Look at this. Mm hmm. The kid of cold reaction too. <laughs> Things they got found at the thrift store, y'all. So let's move it on. And I was looking at the time just now, y'all. So I gotta hurry up so I got the jewelry and stuff. Okay, so I bought a pack of this. Look at this, the nail done went off again. If it do it again, I'm gonna just take it off, y'all. So this half of two seventy nine. I'm an artist. And so once again, I got a whole lot of these just color pencils. Uh huh. They're color pencils and some markers in here. Look like some ink pens in here too. Not bad. Two seventy nine. Not bad for that. Okay. Now look at check out this unusual looking shape bag, y'all. And I got shoes to go with this. I recently thrifted some boots. That'll go with my purse that's over there somewhere. But anyway, I'll put the uh, 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 the playlist to all my thrift hauls. And then y'all could just go in there and see which video it is. But anyway, 
I recently thrifted some uh, ankle boots that look like this. And it'll, it, it goes with my vintage, uh, I think that's an Ann Klein uh, leather purse. That looks just like this. Look at that. Crop print. So we got the two loops because it got a belt in here. Although it's a, uh, I mean, here's the loop here. All right, strap loop. But then here's the other strap loop that the wristlet is on. So you can wear it like this. But look, it's made like a triangle. Isn't that something? And look. So here's the front or the back, whichever one. First of all, it was half of $6.99. Mm -hmm. So look at this. So you can do that and let's go up this where phone go at you can see the length of the phone i'm on my phone now taking this video so i can't show you oh i should have brought my other phone it should be able to slip in there but anyway so that's where phone go out soon because this was in here so that goes there i'm like i never saw a purse like this so that's one side with the wristlet nice wristlet no frame, nothing on. Let me move it up, y'all, because it's taking too long. Okay, here's the back. The other side. The main compartment. And you just open it up. But look, it got the mirror and still got the uh, protective film over the mirror. See? Look at that. Uh-huh. And it got the uh, ID compartment. You can put pen or pencil there. And then you look in there. They got a, the compartment in here, but on the other side, they got credit card block. Can y'all see that? Up in there. All along the credit card block. I don't know if y'all can see that. Hopefully y'all can see that. All the credit card block. But anyway, it's there. Yeah, there they are. And look at that. Isn't that nice? And here's the uh, strap. Look at that chain strap. Put it on the bag and move on. Clip. Come on, clip. Clippy. Clippy. And let's do it till they can, when they can see it. I got to make myself go up. Be up some, y'all. Which I caught myself doing with the pillow head move. Then I'm sitting on. So, y'all, these nails seem like they about to come off. But anyway, I just put them on for show today anyway for the static of the video. And to go with what I got on. Because I wasn't planning on going outside of them. So, I don't mind if they come off. Mm. I'm trying to put this through here. And I'm trying to take care. It, it can open. It just has to. It can it open. Is this the perspective or something? I have to figure out that side, y'all, because I'm having a hard time. But anyway, look at this purse. Nice. What amount it was? Let me move on because we already have 40 something. Look at these shoes. These will be at one at Lady Vintage Shop. These are all man made uh, materials. 11M size. 11M is a comfort view. Patent leather, yellow shoe. Light new condition. Look at this. Where's the other? Let me just see how much this was. Look, on both. Nice condition. On both. Look, light new. On both of them. And so it's open toe. Open toe, half a 13, 29, 11M. These will be at Lady Venice Shop. Look. Nice kitten heel shoe. That could be like a, no more than a two inch heel. Okay, moving right along. Then I had these. The Moma Room shoes. These right here, y'all, are now West. And check them out. They got studs and grommets on here. 
these uh, textile upper balance made men material uh, 10M W N W Morton uh, is the style. But look at this. Check them out, y'all. Like new. Now they're awesome. Uh, look at look at the stud, the detail, the grommet. I'm gonna bring them up close. I was just trying to show y'all all first. Look and look at this. And this smell new. The smell is new. All in my nose smelling new. It just got a little dirt that I got to wipe in there. That's all. But look. Look at the detail on here. All the studs. And the grommet. The different types. Look at that. And all them intact on both shoes. Look at that. What some ball pearl. Isn't these some quaint little... Loafers, slip on loafers. Wow, that's the head you can find at the thrift store, y'all. Okay, the next thing will be. E -e -e -e. Okay, that bag is empty. We coming down to it now, y'all. Check this out. This look like a ostrich print or a snake print. I don't know which one it is. What print is this? Now this straight up dark gray. Dark, dark, dark gray. Almost black, but it ain't black. Look. No wears, no tear. Look at that. Nice sturdy bag. And here's the side. And it clips. The side clips. So we can see how much it expands. Isn't this a pretty bag? On the other side. Oh, clip. Oh, look how nice and sturdy this bag is. Look at this. So it's like this on both sides. It's a gold tone. No spraying on the strap. Very pretty. You got some, uh, couple of, uh, scratches on the go to on hardware but that's okay look at this steady i mean sturdy and then it looks like this and open and i didn't see a name in the door did i over here in the corner no i just say 100 percent pvc made in china and this is how much this bag was. Half a ten ninety nine. Look at that. And there's the inside. So, so the nail finally came off y'all. Look. <laughs> like I said, I got my. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I trying to give y'all a finger. <laughs> excuse me, y'all. But anyway, you see my nails trying to grow. Anyway. <laughs> Sorry about that, y'all. Still got a uh, slip there. And over here, it got a zipper. Nice, big compartment. Basically. Look at this. The things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. I can't believe it. Mm -hmm. The things you can find at the thrift store, y'all. Okay. This one's good. Because I keep trying to bump stuff as I'm trying to put stuff back. And if it come, they come all off today, it don't matter. I like them. Okay, the last things are in this pretty purse. Check it out, y'all. This is a no-name, just a fashion purse. That's those canvas material. Canvas felt. No, this ain't felt. This is uh, something under there, but it's not leather or nothing. It's all fabric. Just a nice fashion bag. Look on both sides. There's the side. Wow. 
Oh, nice. The place you can find at the thrift store. I'm going to try with that chip bottle. It was on the floor just now. Oh, look at that. The thought just got the white. And look at this. Nice shoulder bag. Look at this. Nice shoulder bag, yeah. Hmm. Nice shoulder bag. Pretty. Now, this man. I will keep this. Like, nice bag. Now, see, this is this what I deem luxury. Nice, sturdy bag. Look how sturdy this bag is. And it was only $10, basically. Half a $19.99. Basically, $10 for this. I said, I'm going to pay that $10 for this. Uh, and the man behind the counter said, right. Y'all see the video footage of the shopping spree uh, portion. And he opened it when well, this was opening. And then I'll show y'all the inside. The inside is it's a signature. It say Rex. It say Rex all on it. All on it. It say Rex. I don't know if y'all seen it. But it say Rex. All on it. It say Rex. Can y'all see that? Oh, my. Come in, y'all. Stand still. They could see it say Rex. I don't know if y'all seen it. But the lining say Rex on the inside. Now I got to move on. Okay, so yeah, because the time going. Look at this pretty watch. So all these are fashion watches. Half of $4.99. Look at this. I just liked it because of the print. And it feel good. This feel like fall fur. And on the back it feel like bonded leather. And it says on here, uh, Cans. C-A-N-N-E-S. Quartz watch. So that's what it said, Cairns Quartz Watch. Now on the back it says, Stainless Steel Japan MOV to you. Yeah. So that. So I'll put that there. Here's another watch. This J-A-P-O-N-A -A Quartz Watch. And I got it for the aesthetics again. Because of the pretty they got the roman numerals around there and it's really pretty it's like an aqua blue and on the inside it's stainless steel too and it says this is the uh base metal the bezel yeah isn't that a pretty watch this watch. Yeah, pretty this watch. Mm. But anyway, can't show stuff properly. But I'm trying to speed now because it's about to be an hour. Half a four ninety nine for this. I got a lot of brooches. Look at this pretty brooch. It got seashells, starfish, and other stuff. Seashells. And on the back, pretty metal. I don't know if a name on it or not. I ain't going to look for because I want to just get through this and don't have to have another video. I don't see no name on this, but it's just a pretty brooch. Rhinestone brooch. That was half of $2.99. Pretty. No tarnish on it either. Mm -hmm. Brooch. I never saw a rhinestone brooch. Okay, the next thing is I gotta hurry up because I got a lot of this. Half of $5.99 for this brooch. Look at this pretty brooch. It got uh, fall pearls in it inside some type of a vase. Fall pearl in the flower shape. Brooch. Here's another watch. Elvis Presley watch, y'all. It's a, a Japan part watch. I looked online for this watch. And uh, I can't hardly see it. It says uh, HBL Limited, uh, Hong Kong. It says model number 100 EP, 1989 copyright Elvis Presley Enterprises, Inc. 
Oh, that's what it says there. I don't know if y'all seeing it, but that's what it says. Hmm. And so, of course, and so the stainless steel. So, all of these don't work. No battery, no working battery in none of these watches I bought. But look at that Elvis Presley watch. So, I'm going to be selling these. Some of the watches, not all of them. No brooches will I be selling. This is a you have touched so many hearts a little uh brooch look at that half a 399 look at that half a 399 you have touched so many hearts I'm let me move it up because it's their hearts at the bottom you have touched so many hearts oh isn't that cute quaint brooch uh-oh, I'm getting down to it. Uh-oh, that hour coming out. Now, check these out. Some nice uh, fashion clips. Half of $4.99. Aren't they pretty? So, these are the clip-ons. Let me try one on for y'all. Yep. Let me just try one on. Take this off. Put it right there. And look at it. I was like, I'm going to get this. It's all quaint. Look at that. Iridescent color. Look at that pretty. Aren't they pretty? Let me come in some. Look at that. <laughs> so I'm going to just leave that on. Because the time waits for nobody. Now, I can't read this, y'all. I just can't. Because of all the rhinestones is uh, hurting my eyes. I have poor vision. These glasses are what you call micro lens. They really micro. Uh, my vision real bad. And so I, some things I just can't make out, y'all. So half of three ninety nine. dollars it's a brooch. Can y'all make what that says out? And look at it with the ball pearls. So I can't, I can't tell what that's saying. It's saying something. Isn't that pretty? Well, it's a brooch, and I don't know what it is. And I ain't gonna hurt my eyes for that. I was hurting them too much and can't see what that is. Uh, half a four ninety nine for this one. Look at this. So it's a uh, fall pearl. All this acrylic, basically. But look how it's made though. Pretty with the rhinestones in the middle and the sparkles. Really nice brooch. And was that all? Yep. And now y'all can see the inside of the bag. And it comes with a wallet. And so it has right here, it got two pouches. Come in clear, yep, of things. So people can see, because sometimes they come in clear, and then sometimes they don't want to come in clear. I don't know if y'all seeing it inside. But anyway, it's a wrap. I was trying to stick it out. See it. Are y'all seeing the wraps? Where it's a wrap? It's all on the line. It's a wrap. It's pretty satin, like lion. Black satin shiny, and so we got two of those slip pockets, and that's it in a big opening. Yeah, nice. It's pretty bag again, y'all. Check it out. <laughs> and the wallet, yeah, it came with it. Look at this wallet came with it, y'all. So let's look at the wallet, and so this is how the wallet is. So you open it up and see no wheels, no tails on it. It was like new. And I'm like, I'm going to pay the $10 for this one. So it opens up like that. And then you have you have some uh, credit card slots there. You have a, a pocket there. Then you have a zipper pocket, pocket behind it, and a pocket in front of it. And then you have uh, a pocket here to the side. And then another one here for your ID. And it's real, like hard, like hard, that hard, almost like cardboard inside of here. 
It feels like thick cardboard might be in here. It's real sturdy. The bag and the rock. Will this be the thumbnail? I don't know, but thank y'all for tuning in to see me today and keep me company a little while and put up with my shine and again. I appreciate y'all. If you like the video, give me one or two thumbs up if you can. Please share so it go across the YouTube communities uh, so other people could come over here and see what's really going on and catch each other. Subscribe if you haven't done so. Press the notification bell. You see, bing, so you will be notified each time I upload another catch it tell video. Now, until we meet again, if it is our creator's will, be good to yourself now. Don't forget to love thy neighbor as thyself. Because y'all know love the way to go. Above all, let's love our creator who wakes us up, give us our very being, and provides for us daily. Let's love him with our whole heart, mind, body, soul, and strength with all our might. And keep his commandments, for they are wholly just, righteous, and true, always benefiting whom? Me. And of course you. Peace and the God pay love y'all. Take care. Bye. <laughs>